What do batteries have to do with baseball? Not Duracell batteries, pitcher and catcher batteries. The pitcher and catcher relationship powers the energy for the entire defense, which is why it's called the battery. So what are the secrets? Number one, customize your communication. Different pitchers respond better to different styles of communication. Some need to be coddled and some need to be pushed. Personality tests might help you understand them a little bit more. Number two is know their tendencies. When pitchers struggle, they'll often get sad or mad. If you understand which they tend towards, you can help them regulate before they're too far gone. Number three, do post-performance reviews. After a game or a bullpen, do a quick review with them on a few things that they did well and one thing to focus on doing better next time. Number four, build them up. From pregame to bullpen to the actual game, your body language and words as a catcher should consistently make him feel like he's dominating. It can be a fist pump when they do something well or a little head nod when you know they just threw it exactly where they wanted to. You are their biggest hype man. And number five, tempo. Understand what speed your pitcher likes to work at. Hit them in the chest every time, and typically faster tempo is better. And number six, connect off the field. Your trust off the field directly impacts your performance on the field. Get to know their family's names, their girlfriend's name, and what's going on in their life outside of baseball. And ultimately, just be their friend. So when all the coaches ask how you have such a strong battery, just tell them Coach Bougie taught you.